hello uh, welcome to java tutorial now we are going to see how can we add user libraries uh, in our eclipse uh, id in order to add user libraries uh, in our eclipse id we have to select windows menu uh, then followed by preferences and because we are adding some user libraries we have to select user libraries under this java build path category here and uh, build path and uh, followed by user libraries or else you can simply type user libraries here in search box you will automatically get user libraries he here and then select user libraries option and now we are going to add new user libraries by clicking on this new button so here you can give the library name name in our example we are going to create uh, we are going to add hibernate libraries that's why i am giving a uh, name for this as hibernate libraries After giving name, simply click on this OK and don't select this uh, checkbox because if you select this uh, uh, checkbox automatically for every project, whether you need these Hibernate libraries in your project or not, automatically they will be added to your uh, uh, project. So that's why it is not recommended to select this uh, checkbox. So after entering the library name, simply click on this OK button now you can see your uh, library name appear here so here you just added the library name not the actual libraries means you haven't added any jar files for this user library in order to add jar files to this uh, user library simply select the library you have created and then click on this add jar files uh, as uh, you know i have already downloaded Hibernate libraries from Hibernate website and they are available in my uh, in my system and you can select those options you can go to the place where you have uh, installed where you have downloaded to where you have downloaded and uh, select those libraries itself in JavaSoft I have Hibernate distribution 3.6 select that one and you can see a folder with the name lib so lib means libraries so you can select that folder and here you can see different kinds of libraries uh, that came with uh, hibernate so now let us uh, look at the required libraries required means uh, mandatory library jar files so now we have to add all the required library jar files so when you add libraries you can get all these jar files uh, expanded like this and you can simply minimize all these things and in order to add other hibernate libraries i mean optional libraries you can click on this add jars as usual and go to lib folder and you can find here a jpa libraries which are required when you are uh, writing application i mean hibernate applications using uh, jpa annotations so click on this uh, uh, file i mean the jar file and select open button automatically it was added to your uh, libraries here you can see the added library jar file and you can add some more optional libraries you can choose the same way what we have done so far optional here these are the libraries c3p0 for conferring uh, for configuring the third party cache for hibernate like this you can add the other uh, uh, jar files other li hibernate library jar files now as of now we have added few jar files after adding the jar files i think java assist was added two times and i am trying to remove the jar file one of that and that's it now after adding all the required libraries uh, to your user library you can simply click on this ok button now 
this is the procedure for adding any kind of user libraries to the Eclipse ID. So that's all.